Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the new Dev Home app from Windows 11. Well, the Dev Home app has received an update and in this video, we're going to cover everything that is new because there are quite a few interesting things that were added to the Dev Home app. The update that the Dev Home app received is 0.13 and in this video, we're going to try to cover all the new features that are available. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. This video is sponsored by Private internet access. A virtual private network or VPN for shorts hides your IP address and safeguards your internet connection through an encrypted tunnel. Streaming services such as Netflix have different library options based on where you are located. Using private internet access, you will be able to watch those shows or movies that are not available in your current location. Make sure to check out private internet access in the links from the description below for a great deal. 83% discount and 4 months free. First of all, of course, you're going to have to open up the Microsoft Store and then go into library and then click on get updates to get all the latest updates as you can see minutes ago my dev home app was modified the dev home app is still in the preview stage in the testing zone but it is starting to have some really useful features which we're going to cover in this video so after you do this and you have the dev home app updated you can just open it once you open it you're going to notice that it will also update whenever you're opening it and if you go to settings you should see the new version which is 0.13 i think the dev home app has been changed quite a bit since the last Last time we covered it but as you can see the design is pretty nice it matches the Windows 11 experience and everything is good to go I'm just gonna go quickly through everything that is here basically we have certain widgets which we can use to monitor our CPU GPU network and we can add certain other widgets as you can see we have other things that we can add here and I think that is pretty nice we also have machine configuration basically here we can set up a local machine configuration file clone repositories install applications add a dev drive which will of course open the settings app with the dev drive option inside the settings app and now for the version 0.13 we have a new page which is Windows customization and here we have options for the file explorer and also Windows developer settings and you should also have additionally a new section which is called quiet background processes which can analyze your system I'm not really sure why I don't have it but I'm just gonna show you a screenshot from Phantom Motion 3 of how that will look now if we're going into the file explorer section as you can see we have a few options that are pretty interesting and useful in my opinion for example show file extensions show hidden and system files show show full path and title bar, show files after extraction is complete, show empty drives, and also end task. And I think these are the most useful quick settings that you can do. For example, you want to show the file extensions, just go here, enable this, or you want to show hidden system files, just enable this, show full path and the title bar, and so on. Also the end task section, basically enable end task and taskbar by right click. If we enable this, we should have this new button end task when we right click on a file. And also for demonstration purposes, let's just create a new text document here and let's see if we enable show file extensions if it's going to show the extension as you can see it does so i think this is pretty nice so these options should work pretty good even though they were just released and dev home is still in the preview stage now if we go into windows customization we also have windows developer settings which is a quick link that will redirect us to the settings app into the for developers section and also additionally you could see a new dev drive insights page that was spotted by aaron janker on twitter so you're also going to have a screenshot from that i think the dev home app is shaping up to be a pretty useful app even if you're not a developer even if you're not using the github integration or writing code you could just use the file explorer windows customization section to quickly show file extensions show hidden system files or other quick things like this because if you want to show the file extensions for example in the file explorer you have to go to these three dots click on options and then click on view and then just search for add extensions for null file types disable this and then apply and okay basically i think through the dev home app things should be pretty easier and faster. So this is the new dev home app. I'm hoping that you enjoyed this quick showcase of the new dev home app, the new update 0.13. Let me know below in the comments if you've tested it or if you will test it after watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.